Governor Obike's crisis with Article did not begin during the PDP presidential primaries of 2022. Because way back in 2020, at the time when Article was seriously considering retirement until his children literally, in his own words, forced him to run again, I was having a conversation via email with Atiku. I was complaining about the pulling down of a hotel for breaching COVID protocols in Port Harcourt by Governor Wike. I felt that behavior was confounding to me. Atiku had told me when the conversation went towards the presidential politics that, in his estimation, Wike will be a lame duck by 2022 because, in his own words, Wike cannot match him money for money because Wike will be saving up money for his retirement. There's nothing Wiki was ever going to do that would have sat right with Atiku, especially because Atiku's cabal feared that Wiki's strong personality would be a problem for them if they want to control him. And sure, they will want to control him because after all, they have control over their own master. Now you are going to like this one. Governor Okoa of Delta State is Atiku's running mate for vice president. Prince Olatunji Olusoji is Okoa's senior special advisor on special duties. He's a party-loving man and spends his money on Atiku's campaign. But you can see from his WhatsApp chats and phone conversations with me that he does not want Atiku and Okoa to win. He uses very strong words like, Okoa must perish. He describes Atiku as being desperate, a betrayer, and deceitful. Prince Olatunji is angry about the looting of the resources of Delta State to fund Atiku's desperation. He goes on to assert very strongly that Governor Kwa, his employer, paid a bribe of $5 million to a certain General Gusso, who, along with the PDP chairman Ayu, went around to meet some notable people in Nigeria to ensure that Okoa, rather than Governor Wike, emerged as you know, the VP candidate of the party. Listen very carefully to his words, read carefully his messages, and understand the true state of mind of genuine Atiku followers and supporters who are still within that system. Olusoji is not an ex aide or a former aide like myself. He is a currently serving aide who is angry about both injustice, about corruption, and the likes. Will you also accuse him of having collected 200 million from, from, from some other opponent? Will he be called a blackmailer as well? Listen to the genuineness of his anger and understand the true state of mind of a lot of other Article supporters and aides whose testimonies I will also be putting out in the sequel to this episode. I think there's no game money again. There's no way they money to take on this election now. But why article go the fight to BK? Who are the articles advisors? Okay, okay, um, Bruce, Bruce, yeah. Now, are you? Name is Eh, Especially, are you? is using are you to do the damage. Mm. But the damage will be for all of them now. If the entire party loses, nobody all of them lose. You know what happened? Before the primaries, Okoa and Ayu went round. Ayu carried Okoa. Mm. Okoa went to give, they gave, they gave General Gusa $5 million. Wow. So, so General Gusa went to work on IPB. Okay. IPB and General Gusa, uh, IPB and General Gusa were the ones who imposed Okoa on uh, Atiku. Okay. Yes, sir. Uh, they were the ones. You know, see, as Wiki disgrace, disgrace uh, Atiku. Yes, no. I support Wiki. I stand with Wiki. And in the say Atiku, they lie. Yes, suppose Atiku, the way Atiku, they talk lie. Mm. Atiku, they lie. Yeah, he finished Atiku. Yes, no. Atiku knows, Atiku knows about the plot. He was just going to see Wiki. Uh, Wiki don't disgrace our public now. Nah. Mm. You say your governor don't enter state enter debt and he's saying collect loan of one forty billion over Atiku Mata. Uh this total amount of loan we don't collect uh two hundred and something two hundred almost two hundred and fifty billion. Jesus. Almost two hundred and fifty billion I don't collect oh. this article matter. Oh. Tell the sponsor article. 
I think you say no get money again. Don't bro. They say no get money to take contest selection. What do you say? How would Nigeria get better? And like you, you, you like you rightly said in your message to me the that time, you said Atiku will not uh, appoint people based on competence because he has made promises to different people. Of course. So how is he going to make the country work? How? I won't lie to you, I don't see you, you people winning this election. You will not win this election. They look for money, they want to live like the Nadia Papa election, they want to extort people. Yes. Christ people. No, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> this is a Papa extortion. They, they are still in full area. Kai. I'm broke. This is my. They are still in full area. They are still in full area in Abuja. People don't know them. Mm. Very crazy. You don't know them. Uh, so they, 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 they want to they extort people. Use their Papa election to make money. Atiku's daughter, Hawa, also goes ahead to let me into the most sinister part of that family that lies behind the facade that most people do not know. Quite scary. She reminds me that her father is still a very ruthless fool animal who, once he decides to deal with anybody, will do so mercilessly. And so she says, she threatens that when Atiku, if Atiku wins the presidency, he will, you know, whip her own words, Governor Wike, into shape, into line, into submission. The, the other thing she said, I can't put out here in, in very good conscience, but this should be enough to give you insight, a little, no matter how infinitesimal, you know, into the minds of these people and how they work. Do you want this in Asso Rock? <laughs> Because let's not forget, we are the end of the day. 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 We are the end of the and again, you will love this one even better. Are the words of Atiku's own daughter, Hawa Atiku Uweis, who says to me clearly her father's desperate philosophy that money is the be all and end all in politics. Atiku believes that his money will win him the presidency. She also, you know, states very clearly that her father just does not get it that money cannot buy genuine followership. And this coming from a girl, a, a girl who herself is as desperate as the word desperate in capital letters. I am not the one who said this. Atiku's own daughter said this. Will you also accuse Atiku's daughter of having collected 200 million? Will you call her a blackmailer as well? Hear her very words. And understand the mindset of the person who would have you elect him to become president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. It's never about the money, but he doesn't understand. He doesn't get it, man. Money is important. But money is important to get things done. Yes. But it's not important yeah. to inspire followership. Yeah. If money was important, yeah. that would have been the president of this country twice over. Yes. That's the point. That is the point. Yeah. He doesn't seem to get it. Yeah. He does not seem to get it. Yeah. True. You think it's only about money? Go and ask that. Why is he still facing problem? Mm. Out of all the contenders that have contended for the office of the president of Nigeria, nobody even had the kind of money that Obasanjo mm. has come and gone. El Adwa has come and gone. Jonathan has come and gone. Mm. This one now is here doing his nonsense. Mm. Which one do they have more than that? That's the truth. Which money do they have more than that? That's the truth.